only on Christ 17 TV. I got one for you today. Coming out of Chicago, Illinois. 14 year old kid and his mother. They're in the hot dog stand food place ordering food. Now, the man started beating the kid's mother bad. Trying to knock her out. And the kid comes in and shoots the guy who's beating his mom bad. Not slapped her. He's putting fist on her. Putting, what you say, paws on her. Now, they're charged with murder. Let me just show you something real quick. Show you this real quick. Bond set at $3 million for the 35-year-old Wes Pullman mother, who, according to prosecutors, got into a fierce verbal argument with a Southside restaurant patron. This was Sunday night while they were waiting in line for food. The situation quickly escalating into a deadly encounter. During that altercation, the defendant began texting her son. Cook County prosecutors describing how Carlicia Hood summoned her 14-year-old son who was out in the parking lot late Sunday night at this Maxwell Street Express restaurant at 116th and South Halstead, and then things started heating up. The argument between the victim and the defendant turned physical when the victim punched the defendant in the head approximately three times. The store surveillance video capturing the moment the 14-year-old sees his mother getting punched, investigators say, and that's when the teen allegedly pulls a gun from his pocket. The co-defendant fired a shot at the victim inside of Maxwell, striking the victim in the back. As the victim fled, the co-defendant followed him and fired additional shots. The defendant instructed her son, the co-defendant, to continue to shoot and kill the victim. The 35-year-old Hood, according to prosecutors, ordering her son to shoot another restaurant patron who thought the initial verbal dispute was funny, but the teen wrestling the gun away from his mother. And thankfully, no more shots fired, but the damage was done to 32-year-old male victim succumbing to his injuries, mother and son now facing first-degree murder charges and a host of other offenses. We'll have more coming up at 6 o'clock. At the Criminal Courts Building, Julian Cruz, WG. Now listen here. Gotta you keep your hands to yourself. You beating this woman with your fist in front of her kid, her son. What is he supposed to do? Besides defend his mother. Yeah, he might have chased him out and killed them, but how do you know he's not running to the car to get a gun to come back and kill them both? That's what I'm thinking. This is Chicago, baby. This is Chirac. This happens all the time. Motherfucker will run to the car and get their thing, but the thing be usually on them. All that I'm saying, though, is how you going to charge them? Who hit who first? Yeah, she might have said keep shooting him because she probably feared for her life that he was going to go to the car and get his gun and come back and kill her son and her. He was already punching her. That's the video they didn't show is the part where he's punching her. I've seen it already and it's whack. He's, he's saying on his grandma he's going to knock her out. And he punches this lady repeatedly trying to knock her out and I guess that she... She took the blows because she didn't get knocked out. And the son's watching this. Feeling helpless. He had a gun on him and he shot the guy. If if that was my mom, I would have did the same thing. If I had a gun and you're beating my mom like that, I'm going to shoot you. And I'm going to try to kill you. That's just son protecting his mom. That's what a son is supposed to do when somebody's trying to hurt your mother. That's just how it goes. I don't think anybody should be charged in this at all. What is No matter what kind of argument they had, you have no right to punch this lady in the face and try to in front of her kid too. What is the kid supposed to do? Watch? 
He's supposed to watch his mom get beat to a pulp? I don't think so. He did what any son is supposed to do. Protect his mama at all costs and by all means. I wish... <laughs> I wish a motherfucker would try to give me a charge for protecting my mom. They got the the video is online of this guy punching her repeatedly like three, four times in the face in front of this lady's son. You know, it's just a bad thing. You know, he should have never hit her. And he said, oh, my grandma. Well, now you about to go meet your grandmother. Because this little kid is not going to have somebody beating his mom to a pulp. He took it into his own hands, which I think is self-defense, and shot the man. Yeah, I would have chased him out to make sure he doesn't come back and hurt my mom more. He's already said he's going to knock her out. Now that I did something to him, he's probably going to come back and try to do something to both of us. Absolutely, he was in the right. Chicago... You got this one wrong, man. You need to drop the charges. $3 million bail for a lady who was getting beat the fuck up by a man at a hot dog place? Come on now. Get real. What's the kid supposed to do? Watch his mother get beat to a fucking pulp? Are you kidding me? How do you know that kid didn't think that guy was trying to beat his mom to death? Man, free them both. Rest in peace to that dude. Unfortunate situation for everybody. Whatever argument they were having, the outcome was not worth it for nobody. Now you got you and your son in jail. This guy's dead. I don't know who started the argument, but look now. Nobody wins. Everybody's a fucking loser. It's sad, but as a... As somebody who loves their mother with everything, I couldn't watch somebody beat my mom and I don't do something to try to kill this guy. And if I had a gun and I'm 14 year old kid, I'm going to use it. I'm going to try to help my mom not get hurt and killed. And if that means I got to shoot and kill you, I'm going to trade my mom for you every time. Every single time. A hundred out of a hundred times. It's not going to rock like that. So I don't understand why her bail is so high. They got other people getting murders and their shit don't never be that high. Three millions a lot. Even for murder. In Chicago it happens all the time. You know, and I just feel bad for the son because he had to watch that and now he had to use deadly force to protect his mom. And now he's getting a charge. His mom's getting a charge because she told him to shoot him more. Well, what do you think she's supposed to say when the guy's r running off, not knowing if he's going to his car to get his gun and come back and kill them both? She was absolutely right for saying shoot him more. Make sure he don't come back and shoot us and kill us both. Man, this a boy, this is a sad situation. Chicago, man, y'all got to do better than that, man. Y'all got to drop them charges. That's self-defense. What is that boy supposed to do when, when that man is beating his mother with a closed fist? This is a man versus a woman. With a kid watching his mother get beat to a pulp. What would you do? Would you let your mother get beat to a pulp while you had a gun on you? Leave in the comments and let me know what would you do if you were that kid. Would you have let him run off being shot once and maybe return from his car with his gun and kill your mama and you? Or... Would you take the threat out immediately to make sure nothing else happens to your mother? She's already been beat. You shot him once and he ran out. Who knows what he ran out to go get? Me, I don't see anything that should be charged with this young man 
and his mother. This is self-defense at its finest. I know it happened at a food spot and it wasn't somebody breaking in your house and that kind of stuff. But when somebody's beating the shit out of your mother, there's only one thing to do. And that's protect your mother. And if you got to kill somebody to do that, so be it. So be it, man. That's how it's going to have to be if you hit him. my mom and I'm that kid. I'm going to shoot you and I'm going to make sure there's no more threat of you going to get nothing. I'm going to shoot you again till you're finished. Yeah, sounds harsh, but for a 14-year-old a kid who seen his mom get beat, probably feared for her life. And if he's fearing for her life, then he has the right to protect her at all costs. And I think this shit is a fucked up situation and they need to be released. This is Christ 17, man. I just had to touch on this sad shit because this young man did everything in that he could to protect his mama. Who knows if he didn't shoot that guy, he could have been beat the mom to death. We don't know that part. They won't show the part where where the guy's beating the mom on the news. They just want to show the kid in the doorway. He's in the doorway seeing his mom getting beat. And guess what? He shoots the guy beating his mom. And I, you know what? Congratulations, kid. Because that's what you're supposed to do to protect your mother at all costs. Anything necessary to get your mom and you up out of there safe, alive, you got to do what you got to do. Because that, that guy was threatening her, um, I'm going to knock you out. Who tells a woman they're going to knock him out but some kind of punk motherfucker? If you argue with the lady, get your shit and get on. It's not worth it. You don't put your hands on women, let alone I'm going to knock you out and that's on my grandma. Guess what? You're not here and you're going to go meet your grandmother now. And you could be with her now because you tried to hurt somebody's mother. What would that guy do if somebody was beating his mother in front of him? I'm pretty sure he would have did the same thing that the young man did. And shoot the motherfucker if he had a gun on him. I know it sounds fucked up, but listen. These days, they're doing fucked up shit. And anything you got to do to protect you and yours... It's a must. Like that should have never happened. But guess what? People act some kind of way. They're having a bad day. And he might have been having a bad day and took it out on her. And guess what? His day just got worse because now he's not here. So leave your thoughts in the comments. This is Christ17 TV. Like, subscribe, share my videos, and thank all my supporters. Thank you so much. Have a blessed day, but please, what would you do if that was you at 14 and your mother was getting beat? Leave in the comments because I'm dying to hear you guys, what you guys say. Because I say, shoot the guy. I'm 14, you're beating my mom. What else? You got the thing on you already, right? Okay. Shoot the motherfucker. I know it sounds foul. I don't condone that, but when it comes to your mother and your kids... By all means necessary, do what you got to do to keep them alive and keep them safe. And now look, a funeral, now two court cases. Nobody wins here. Everybody loses. Free the kid, free the mother. That is self-defense. Like and subscribe. Christ 17 TV. Have a safe and a blessed day.